Hey guys, Eva here. I'm here at Grape Fest in Grapevine, Texas. It's their 32nd annual festival where wineries from across the world like Texas, California, and Spain all come together. Let's go check out all they have to offer. I'm here with Wayne Rogers. He is a winery from uh, based off of Love, Lubbock, Texas. Yep. So you can just tell us a little bit about your wine, um, sure. how it is created, where does it come from? Sure. Well, first of all, like you said, uh, to Yano Essicado, we're out of Lubbock, Texas. Uh, most of our grapes come out of the Texas High Plains, uh, which is actually actually what Yano Essicado means. It means High Plains. So uh, we harvest all our grapes from there, and uh, yeah, the winery is in Lubbock. Been in business for uh, almost. 46 years now, so I've uh, been doing this. I think we've been here day one uh, at the festival, so we're, awesome. we're enjoying it. And what type of wine do you guys drink? You, you'd be surprised. You know, most people know us for our sweet red, but we have a wide range uh, portfolio uh, from a sweet to a big bold Cabernet uh, that actually just won uh, a gold medal at the Houston Rodeo, awesome. our 2015 Viviano. So. Uh, something that we're really proud of. So you can find all the wines, uh, yano.com, or you can go to any of your local grocery stores and get it. That's exciting, that's awesome. Well, thank you so much for your time. Is there anything else that you would like to say about your wine? Hey, you uh, drink Texas wines. You know, the best Texas wines have not been made yet, and we're really excited for the future. So thanks right. for the time. Well, thank you so much, and I really appreciate it. You got it, it. thank you, thank you. Hey guys, I'm Eva and I'm here with Maria. She owns a winery in California. So can you tell us a little bit about your winery and what you all do, how this started? Okay, yeah, we're I'm fourth generation to test a vineyard. So my uh -huh. great grandparents came over from Italy and settled in Calpella, started planting grapes and making wines. And then in 2010, we got our, our winery going again. We were selling grapes for a hundred years and it was time to start making wine again. So that was my job, and I started making Testa Black and Testa White, and people are loving them, and we also have some varietals. And everything that you do is made from scratch? Is it homemade? It's all handmade by me and my family. We do not add anything during our production. It's just grapes, and people can taste the, the life to the, to the wine. So people are in Texas are asking me for sweet wine, and I said, no, it's not Texas sweet, but it's Give it a chance, let it roll over your tongue, and it will get to that sweet mm -hmm. spot and um, wake it up. So yeah. is there any way we can find out more about your wine or anything like that? Yeah, you can go to testerranch.com, and then we have a Facebook page that links from there. We have Instagram, all, right. all the fun stuff. Perfect. Well, I really appreciate your time, and thank you so much. Make sure to check them on um, their social medias to find out more about their wine and give them a try. Hey guys, we're here with Aitor Marina. He is a winery from Spain. So can you tell us just a little bit about um, your wine and where it comes from? How did you create it? Yeah, well, I import uh, some of these wines. So uh, FYI, I mean, it's mainly a, a Rioja region. Okay. There are uh, different wineries from uh, Rioja. Rioja is mainly known for uh, two white wines. A white called Viura and a red wine uh, called Tempranillo. Cool. And how did you end up picking the specific wine that you brought here to yeah, the festival? So, so what I do is, uh, I'm from Spain myself, so every time I go back to Spain, I, I pick a region. In, in this case, imagine Rioja, right? So I, I have really good contacts in Rioja, and they tell me you should visit these 10, 15 wineries. I go to the wineries, I try different wines, and those wines that I like, or I think they make sense for the American market, I, I import them. All right, awesome. So uh, where exactly can we find yours? You can, uh, so we can find them in, at Specs, uh -huh. we can find them at Total Wines, uh, and we also have a wine club that we can, uh, we can sell it directly to the, to the end council. Okay. Yep. Perfect. Well, thank you so much for your time, and we really no appreciate you. Yes, thank thank so you. It was a pleasure meeting you. Grapevine Fest was so amazing. From their live music, awesome food, especially their wine. Make sure to check them out next September with Grapevine TVB.